Hi, thank you so much for tuning in. When a woman no longer shows you her emotions, react to things, how she's supposed to react to them, like show feelings, this is not because the woman no longer feels for you or that she kind of trying to be hard. It takes a lot of time for someone, mostly women, to build these boundaries, trying to restrict themselves from showing you or telling you what they feel but because either she has shown these emotions before and they were taken for granted or when she feels weak sad broken you didn't show her that you felt something that you are emotional that you have feelings you can be soft and console her a kind of coming her down talking to her trying to know what her problems are when you don't show this to that person the person won't be able to show you after some time it's like crying onto someone when you cry onto someone about your problem each time you go to this person and you cry about your problems. This is my problem, like you're telling the person. And this person's reply is silent. Or this person is treating this, your problem, very light. Like it's not really a problem. It seems now like you are doubting what that person is telling you. You are not believing the weight of what the person is telling you then this you not trusting the person makes the person not to come to you again to tell you this problem the person has after all you do not believe me you are not going to do anything about this problem because of this a woman closes her heart and decide not to tell you anything even sometimes it leads to something happening to you like you're sick and you expect this woman who used to run here and there do you need medicine you need to go to hospital she's not reacting like that most times men forget that the love you show to someone mostly women is very powerful this love how you treat a woman is very powerful is the background the foundation the start you building that relationship because you are meant to supply that love that generates every area in your relationship the love you supply is the thing that circulates all around your relationship so when this love you have is not enough to do some things it works what it needs to do in a relationship what happens you get limited attention everything you need might not be covered because you are stingy in spreading the love you are like someone who is riding a vehicle and on the way because you do not have enough oil in your tank there's no way you reach to your, you can't reach to your destination no way because your vehicle is lacking oil it can move but some people misunderstand this this woman because she didn't get that thing, this reply she expects from you. She couldn't get the seriousness, you know, when something happened that is serious. You did something to make somebody upset. And the person expects that you notice that she is not happy about this thing you have done. And your reaction becomes, you look at the person and say, What's my problem? 
why is she keeping her face like this this person is hot and your reply is silent someone who is hot is suffering the person is not happy and you feel very comfortable like some people would even pretend they didn't see it and they continue normal like nothing happened then it becomes your turn you are in the shoe of that person who was angry yesterday now you want the person to react the other way yes women are like mothers wives it's not going to really be easy for her to close up her heart and say i'm not going to feel anything of course she'll be feeling something at the beginning but the anger in her heart the regret she has for still showing you love though yesterday you ignored her she went ahead and showed you love sometimes women are like oh this thing i'm doing for you i'm not going to do it but they see themselves doing this because you are the partner a male they know this service is an important thing this mother figure is an important thing this feminine reaction and duty service pity mercy call it forever it's in us so you just move even when you don't want to move like you hear someone is hungry someone needs help you move it's you just move because your emotion pushes you you have it and you move to help the person you've already already reached out to help the person and you now notice oh this person that i'm so eager to help couldn't help me yesterday so you keep regretting why you did what you did yesterday and now you're at it again you're trying to help this person who doesn't want to help you who doesn't want to recognize and accept that he has wronged you you are here helping the person again so you start holding back holding back your feelings before you could know it the woman is a woman who doesn't react to your worries who doesn't care again about how you worry if something is happening to you she doesn't care because women they learn fast in all honesty i've tried out most things i tell you in my video and i've had most close friends to tell me this thing i'm telling you a woman is just what you want the woman to be because women they have time to plan to target and wish expect what they want their relationship to be but men are a kind of a little too busy to think of this because we want this comfortability this much peace much much living in a very conducive and comfortable environment to feel safe when you bring peace kindness love you shower blessings kind words to your wife to your female partner just try to play all nice and check out what i'm telling you and check the kind of peace that will be in that relationship how everyone is going to be happy how she's going to be smiling all around just try it out and see the difference but when you are supplying only negativity into the relationship, what happens? You come home and you see front face. You see people who are no longer laughing and smiling each time. You will get excitement. Someone who is so happy, laughing, smiling each time the person sees you or each time the person calls on the phone. There will be forgiveness because there is hope that... It doesn't matter what happened, it's not going to be too bad. But when there's 
much negativity, things that are scarce and worry this person who is your female partner. Even when you ask for forgiveness or when you make promises, it will be accepted but not fully accepted because the person do not believe in this thing you are saying. So most of the problems we have in our relationship is us. Us, we are the problem. The same it is for a man, the same it is for a woman. When we do not show enough kindness in our relationship, enough emotions, enough gratitude, and we don't like to share things we have, it doesn't matter what it is. Just sheer kindness, sheer love. Instead of hatred, bearing, grudges, unforgiveness, these are the things that are making our relationship spoil because we can't just open our hearts and be good to the person. When we all, always like to see the person down, we like to see this person sad because when you say you don't like to see the person sad, you would have switched the button when you are here and you have headache and I, I needed to come to you to encourage you to tell you it will be well. Your headache will soon be over and I gave you something to drink to ease your pain and I gave you medicine and I speak with you. I calm you down. I hold you. I sit beside your bed to make life easier for you at that moment when you needed me. There's nothing for you to hate me about. Because I was good to you. But when I leave you in your pen and go to somewhere and start pressing my phone, and you went through that pain, uncomfortability, without someone to console you, to be with you, to, to calm you down, to feel your pain, to understand what you're going through. That moment you are sitting there left alone by yourself. You were thinking, how could it be possible for that person to leave you here that you're sick and go? This is negative. The action from the person is negative. The action that is somehow in you now is negative because that's what the person supplied. This lady who left you there when you were sick, her supply negativity, something that is bad in her character, in her kind of person, what you received is bad here. There's no way you can feel good in the bad she's doing to you. You will feel sad. So is that also to the woman. Let's say you come back from work or from anywhere and you were so tired, you needed a cup of water. Or you needed someone to talk to how excited you are about something and you you wanted this person's attention because telling somebody about something you like so much is a kind of fun and you were so happy you couldn't wait to tell the person and you got there the person doesn't have time to listen to this thing you want to say you know you are like disappointed so it's also to a woman so love is all about sacrifice. Relationship is all about sacrifice. But when one of us sits down and receives, the person wants to be served like a king or a queen, and the other person did not receive the same value, weight of what the person has put in that you have received. Woman or man, doesn't matter. I will repeat it again. Then the problem in that relationship starts. The person, it's normal that the person will be weighed down. <laughs> the person will be tired of giving, tired of supplying. And the moment that thing the person is giving to you emotionally, the person just supplying, supplying, and you do not return. Because it has, it has a way of finishing. You could finish. Imagine I have I have this now and I'm giving it to you. I'm just giving you, giving you, giving you, giving you. One day to finish. It finishes 
because you are not returning whatever that is given to you need to be returned just for us to have enough to give back it's very easy easy mathematics i gave you you use when i needed you return very easy i put it back inside here and i will give you back the next time you need it here will be full of love full of emotional support full of kindness generosity love that smile will not finish here the relationship cannot fade the love will not fade the relationship will not stop it will continue to go before you can ask for please forgive me you could even be told there's no need to apologize but when wickedness self-centeredness and seeing yourself as better you are the one who deserves to be loved begged pampered helped and the other person not then we start to have problem that is one of the problems that relationship have nothing else just for us to, to come to an agreement and say we want to make it work we want to be happy if it's possible say it come to agreement and say this is how we are going to do it and when the other person is shifting away from the agreement you wake the person up no it's not what we said though you're going the wrong way and we do it open heart deadly with elevated mind and everybody will be happy why would this relationship stop even when we see that it works so much for we and this person and why wouldn't we worry that we won't be able to find someone like this hmm? so that's it talking today about why someone who used to be emotional who shows her feelings towards a partner no longer feel like showing it thank you so much for watching so far please if you've not subscribed to my channel do well to subscribe to my channel love you guys and see you next time in my next video bye bye, -bye. hi my name is chama you're welcome back to my video i do relationship video just elementarily all what that happens to us in relationship any topic that has to do with relationship and i'll be happy for you to subscribe to my channel subscribe and you get to interact from time to time thank you so much and thank you my wonderful subscribers thank you so much thank you i'm so happy each time before you subscribe i'm like please subscribe to my channel and when you have subscribed i'm like oh my god i say it loud thank you oh somebody has subscribed but there's no way you could hear me i appreciate Take care. Thank you.